What is up guys, back in today with another reaction on the channel. Today I'll be reacting to One Piece fan letter. Um, I think this is one of the first One Piece reactions I have on the channel. I did do an opening reaction a few years ago, but I think I might have private that video. Um, yeah, just an old video, which uh, terrible quality, but um, looking forward to uh, this. I think I'm allowed to watch this. I'm not fully caught up on One Piece. I'm about 600 episodes through on Punk Hazard, so um, I think this is just until after... Marineford, I think. So obviously, watch that. Probably my favourite bit of One Piece uh, so far. I absolutely loved it. Um, in general, of course, I've watched six hundred bloody episodes. So <laughs> there's a obviously wouldn't be watching six hundred episodes of anything if I didn't like it. But um, yeah, looking forward to seeing what this is about. I've heard uh, a few things about what this is going to be covering, and I think it is adapted from a novel. So um, yeah, looking forward to it. Uh, let me know what you guys think about this down in the comment section. Make sure to leave a like on the video if you guys do like and subscribe to the channel if you want to keep up to date. And let's get right into it. I'm interested to see like the animation style and such as well. I've seen shots here and there of like current episodes, and it looks very different to what I'm used to. So, but yeah, hopefully there's no like spoilers here or anything. <laughs> oh shit! Wow. Yeah, already the style looks very different. I like this though. There's Marco. I like Marco a lot. Haven't seen him since Marine Ford, of course. Um, okay, sorry about that. I just uh, want to rewind for a second. Turn it up a little bit. But yeah, that looks smooth as hell already. Like I said, I have seen a few segments of like uh, recent ish episodes. And they look fantastic. That's what kind of got me to start the series. That Kizaru. Diamond Jozu. I love Diamond Jozu as well, man. <laughs> Diamond Jozu is sick. I hate that guy, though. The uh, the purple guy, I can't remember his name, but I he really sucked ass. Gekko Moria, that's the one. I hated him. So as I said, I've heard a little bit about what this is going to be about. I think this is like a perspective from normal people. So yeah, these people, just like ordinary people. And this girl does resemble Nami a little bit, doesn't she? But yeah, I saw everything that they played there. That was awesome, that was, by the way. Uh, I just love the soul of this show. It just like it's got so much charm to it, and they're like some of my favorite types of shows. I'm currently watching Natsume Yujin Show, which is different but has that similar aspect to it to One Piece. My nice shot. Hmm. At this point, where I'm at, not 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 quite. Pretty sure Mihawk is still the top dog. 
But there's um again in the arc I'm currently watching, there's something that someone brought up about a um samurai island. Wano, I think it's called. So there might be even stronger swordsmen there, who knows? Iceberg! Oh, hey, look who it is! Awesome! I, ha I haven't seen these guys since that arc. I really enjoyed this arc, by the way. There he is! A bit of ice Iceman. Iceberg. But yeah, this is uh, Frankie's hometown, isn't it? Really enjoyed that arc. I, again, even though it was uh, kind of Frankie's arc, I think... Um, what's her name? Oh, sorry guys, sorry the timer. Robin had a uh was probably my favourite one of my favourite parts of that arc honestly. But yeah, I'm I'm enjoying the animation style. It reminds me a little bit of one of the movies I've watched which I uh really liked. I can't remember what it's called though. Oh, hey, hey, think of the devil. And yeah, this is also one of the places. I think this is where I think it is. I don't remember the name. But um, yeah, I think it might be Sabaldi with the. I can't remember the name of the um. The guys, but the the people with like the astronaut looking helmets. Sorry to keep pausing, guys, but that was also one of the my uh, celestial dragons. I think they're called. That was also one of the moments that got me just like I know it was like four hundred odd episodes in, but that was one of the moments that really kind of got got me hooked. Uh, the episodes there, especially towards the end with um with the slave tradery and such, I thought that was really uh really impactful. But um, again, because I haven't actually reacted to this series, I'm probably going to bring up quite often some of my thoughts towards previous arcs as you guys haven't got to see me react to them. I've been watching my own time. I, I'm just watching them too fast to react to. Like, if I tried recording all that and uploading it, it would take a hell of a long time. But once I do catch up, which might be quite some time, <laughs> I will... Uh, although, I think One Piece is on a break, so it, which is good for me. But um, I will do reactions weekly once I do catch up, if I catch up. Are these Brook fans? Oh, I'm a big fan of this woman as well. More, more so of her design. I really like her design. I think she's with Mihawk currently where I'm at in the anime. It's on like random island. So is this set during when they were all separated? I'm, I'm assuming now then. <laughs> Okay, so this is before they met back up, I think. Again, good news for me. No spoilers. I've got no clue who that guy is. I don't recognize this guy. Sorry, guys.
<laughs> I was just depressed about that. Good excuse that. Ah, uh -huh, look at that, she got a couple of oranges. That's a nice little uh, reference back to Nami's backstory as well, isn't it? Yeah, this guy looks like a, a really knockoff Sanji. Marine knockoff Sanji. Well, fuck you too. Big fan of, um, yeah, big fan of Nami's backstory, by the way. Big fan. It really sucks as well that they're remaking the, um, the is it Water, is it Water 7, is it called? The, the one with fucking, um, what's that, what's that guy's fucking name? I hate, <laughs> what's, I hate his name, um. I can't remember, but yeah, the um, the arc just before Punk Hazard, I really struggled through that. To be honest with you guys, I didn't enjoy that very much at all. Um, it was really long. I think it was like seventy episodes, and it 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 really felt like it could have been like thirty or twenty episodes. And it really sucks ass because they are remaking it into about thirty episodes. So I I really wish I didn't watch it, and I just um I could watch the remake of it. And uh, that would have been a much better experience, I think, because, uh, like I said, it wasn't too bad, to be honest, with the topics covered and such. I really liked uh, the Tiger, I think it is. I really like, enjoyed his character, seeing his backstory and uh, the, um, the the Queen, I think it is, her backstory as well, I thought was really interesting. But, um, yeah, all, all the stuff with that. Hordy Jones, that's the guy I fuck. That, that character sucks ass in my opinion <laughs> i really couldn't stand it just because i think it was more of a kind of a, a time thing of i'd set like 70 old episodes with the geezer so i was bound to but yeah the pacing in the arc was absolutely terrible so um yeah really wish i i kind of waited and then i could uh watch the remake of it i'm gonna watch the remake of it anyway i think but um yeah that kind of sat with my opinion on that arc. it was really struggle to get through i don't know why it took me about two or three months to get through but I'm, uh, I'm kind of blazing through Punk Hazard right now. Let's get a nice, uh, nice support, Soge King. I mean, he doesn't, he's, I think, to be honest, Akali might be one of the strongest people I've seen in the series so far. Although for me, personally, I feel like Blackbeard is, right now. Fucking replaced it. Oh. This is a bit of shit chat. Come on. I don't know, I kind of like the guy. Yeah. 
But yeah, I think Akanu is definitely up there. Who I think is one of the most powerful. And yeah, Blackbeard obviously having two fucking level fruit powers is uh yeah. The darkness one as well just seems ridiculous. I can understand why. <laughs> I can understand why you wouldn't like him. I I quite like the dude though. I think it's pretty fun. <laughs> no way. Was he trapped under the uh I forget that guy's name, but um, there's so many characters all of these guys. You you guys know I'm terrible with names anyway. But, um Yeah, the unfortunate dead body of the uh the giant that was trapped under there. I don't know, just uh just a random foot. Man, that that fucking I love those I love those scenes of a reforward. So much power to the voice actor. It's so sick. Let's rewind that. So is that is that like Kizaru fighting up there? And that's just like again the the view of a of a spectator. You you don't see nothing but these like shining lights. I think I kind of almost remember the scene of him like flashing around perhaps a little bit. But uh, yeah, as a normal person, you just see doo -doo -doo -doo. see nothing. That's quite interesting, that, isn't it? Seems to have resonated with Luffy, even though they're on opposite sides of... Yeah, that's the, that's the power of the, the 2B... Uh, yeah. Legend of... Uh, Legend of the Grand Line, Luffy. Kaizakawoni. This thing I, I actually remember more the, the Japanese <laughs> than the, the English kind of translations for it. In one in one piece quite a bit. So that was his leg. Okay. It is a miracle anyone apart from these fuckers surviving this battle, isn't it, to be honest? These are absolute monsters going at it. Essentially, yeah. It's just, just as they met up. <laughs> oh dear. Ah, oh, oh, look at these fucking rats. That's awesome as well. I've seen them a couple of times now.
I can't believe she's going this far. Man, those pacifist pacifistas were terrifying in uh Yeah. Although I really wish we knew more about the, the guy they designed them from. He seemed like a really nice dude actually. That they kind of sacrificed himself as well. This guy seems quite nice as well. Who is this guy? Fine alive. <laughs> That's a pretty uh pretty good title actually. Super live. Really? Legend. Legend of the game. Man, he was awesome doing that arc. So the that arc was fucking phenomenal. One of my favourites. Oh crap! What was the deal with that thing? What are these insects about? I don't remember seeing that it, these guys. Giant insects around it. Nice. Oh, nice. She still left it there. Oh, God. <laughs> Whose lips are that big? Kinda, yeah. It's amazing, isn't it, the influence? Oh shit. Oh, this guy again? Why are you worried about intruders? The enemy ship is right there in front of you. Well, you, it's right there and you're not even you're worried about a little girl.
Need those tempos, Nami. Come on, Nami, get get it. <laughs> need those uh need those tempos. Oh, there's a letter. What is that little ship, by the way? Crappy little ship. Ah, oh, it's everyone. Let's go. <laughs> hey. Why? Why is there a desk there? <laughs> of all places, guys. Ah, he's here to help as well. Let's go. I oh, know he's gonna try and stop that. But he's gonna help. Ah, uh, she is. Damn, that was pretty fucking awesome, wasn't it? I like that a lot. Is that? I remember there's more of these. I think I've heard there's more of these. I'd love to see them adapted if uh if they could. And that Wow. Again, that was awesome as fuck, wasn't it? Love that. Love the little look backs and like past uh, arcs and events. Most of the ones, ones being the. Oh! We've got Luffy singer. Is he San Sanyon? <laughs> okay. I've oh, got the whole cast singer. Okay. I haven't heard a cast song. I imagine there's maybe more. Again, I did react to the opening years ago, but. um. That was yeah, that was years ago, so Where's Soul King? I wanna I wanna hear his rock. We're gonna win now. Do, 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 do. There the, there he was and um I'm not sure how he became a professional. <laughs> Such is a sunshine. But yeah, I will say again, the animation looks very fluid now, doesn't it? It looks very, there's a lot going on. Um, where again to where I'm at anyway there's um there's not it's not nearly as fluid it's not nearly as there's not nearly as much animation in each scene um, and I don't mind it too much I'm a really big fan of the giant faces and mouths <laughs> which sounds strange but I love the overreactions of the characters um, but yeah as we see here again I really wish I waited because yeah, yeah, they're doing the Fishman Island arc, which again I really disliked because it was paced very poorly. But um, yeah, looking forward to actually watching it again with some better pacing.
A new beginning. The store hats reunite. So yeah, thank you guys for watching. Uh, again, really awesome actual return for me for One Piece uh, on the channel. Like I said, um, this being the first thing I watch, uh, it was a hell of an episode, wasn't it? Really enjoyed this. Again, seeing the perspectives of these kind of civilians and uh, seeing them all on their own kind of journeys, however little they may be, um, seeing their own kind of adventures and such. Really like the uh, the main girl. The, the little Nami fan girl, especially of course, it was mainly focused on her. But uh, I especially did like the brothers as well. I thought that was a really because that was one of the biggest. Uh, that's probably one of my favorite, if not perhaps my favorite, kind of parts of One Piece so far is the whole um, Ace Luffy saga and how that ended as well. Um, yeah, just one of the most impactful things. So I I really enjoyed that kind of segment to this as well. But again, the uh, the kind of re um, looking back at past arcs and little. Uh, little bits of the characters here and there and such I thought was really well done and uh, like I said big fan of the animation I uh, love the uh, car sunk ending here as well it was just uh, really awesome um, but yeah do let me know if you guys thought of this down in the comment section um, again and luckily no spoilers thank god uh, maybe there was again there was a few things I didn't kind of recognise here I didn't recognise the, the guy that loved Chopper maybe he's a character that um, he, he might just be for these novels I'm not sure but Maybe he might be a part of the series later on. I didn't recognize the giant bugs either, but obviously uh, it's not really a massive deal. Uh, but yeah, again, let me know you guys want in the comments. Leave a like on the video if you guys did like and subscribe to the channel if you want to keep up to date. Um, and I'll see you guys. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm going to react to the Fishman Island arc. Um, as I said, I really wish I didn't watch it because then I would definitely react to it being something that I haven't watched before on the channel. Um, I'm not sure if I want to watch something I've already watched before on the channel it, i mean it will be different but i'm not sure it'll be different enough to warrant as much of a reaction and like i said i wasn't a major fan of i wasn't a major fan because of the pacing so i imagine that would be remedied so um i don't know i'll think about it but, um yeah if you guys want to see that let me know in the comments but yeah um see you guys uh whenever i hopefully catch up and have a good rest of your day